Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are doing a Walmart new arrivals haul. I'm gonna be trying these pieces on, sharing my first impressions. It will all be listed below in the description box. But if you did not know, it's the first week of spring. I have added flowers to the set. The sun is shining and I am just in the mood for all the spring things. So all week long, I'm gonna have new spring themed videos from home finds, some spring favorites. I might even do a little spring cleaning around here, so be sure to hit the subscribe button and come back. And just fair warning in today's video, I have gone ahead and opened everything. I recently went on a trip and I had to bust into some of these packages so I could pack for that trip. So I was anxious to get back over here and see what was actually in this order. And we're starting out with a good one. One of my favorite things every year to get from Walmart and Target is their beach bags. But these I think are a little bit more elevated than just your typical nylon beach bag. This one does have an open weave. It has kind of a natural raffia feel. There's no pockets. It's just gonna be one large open compartment. This is a 16 by 24 rectangle, so I think it's a great size. I like this one so much that I did pick up two of them. The first one is this white and blue that says, here comes the sun. And then I also picked up this yellow one that says Soleil, which actually this looks like the same color as a Target swimsuit I just got. So I hope the color matches on this, but I would wear this with any color swimsuit. Actually, it would look fantastic with black. It's also available in a third option that I'll flash on the screen, but these are 20 bucks. And up next, I have this white top from Time and True. If it's still kind of cool where you are or you're getting balmy weather, this is a great option to still look seasonally appropriate. So it does have this eyelet detail. I think online they're actually calling this crochet and it is see-through. So this is one that you're gonna wanna wear with a bandeau. You're gonna wanna wear this with a little white cami underneath. It is quite pretty. It did look a little oversized online, so I actually sized one down in this to an extra small. Okay, now that I'm looking at it closer, it does come with a built-in cami sewn in, so I love that. This top has great details from this kind of little, very small ruffle collar. It has a V-neck and then it's a button-down style. But what I really like about it too is this elastic at the wrist. I think you're gonna be able to push this up if you want and it's gonna actually stay put. This top's selling out very quickly in the white. It is available in purple, which I believe is the same purple as the top that I have on, which is also from Time and True. We will link anything similar below in the description box. And if you can't get it online, but you're really loving it, I would look for this top in store. Now, I like how they had it styled just very simply with a pair of denim shorts. I have ordered, I think, every pair of denim shorts from Walmart, so that way we can compare. I know I have a few in today's order, but this pair right here is from Scoop. This is what they're calling their retro boy denim short. I did pick these up in a size four. I can already tell they have a lot of stretch to them. So this pair is what they're calling their medium wash. It does have pretty significant distressing on both sides, and then it does have a frayed hem. Depending on which wash you go with, the distressing is completely different. These are $22. I picked these up just in my regular size and they're also available in white. And this next swimsuit reminds me so much of an airy swimsuit that I had last year for about three times the price. Also the tangerine color on this I thought was so good. This is from No Boundaries. I did pick it up in a size medium. So we will see how that fits. It does have a pretty significant cutout, which I actually think is really flattering. If you wanna have a little bit more fun than just a one piece, but you aren't wanting a full on bikini, a monokini like this is such a good option. It does have adjustable straps. It does look like it's gonna be a full coverage bottom. And what I got to go with this swimsuit, also from No Boundaries, is this cover up. I mean, how fun is this groovy print. It has that same orange tangerine color. It has obviously lots of blue. I'll just throw it on here real quick. So it's an open front with this little tie detail, which the tie does have these cute little tassels on the end. It also has this kind of see-through crochet down the whole front. You also have it on the sleeves. Obviously would make a great swimsuit cover up, but I could see myself wearing this with just a tank top, the same pair of denim shorts. And I'm wearing this in a medium. It's also available in black, but I loved the print from the little flowers. It also has some strawberries on it, the softer colors. I think this is a really good buy for the season. Both the swimsuit and the cover up are $19 each. And I'm seeing lots of hot pink, which is a personal favorite of mine, but I was so excited to get my hands on these pieces. It really looks like something that you would see 
from Scoop as opposed to Time and True. So I did pick up all different variations of it. The first piece is the top. It's gonna be this blazer. It's a linen blend. It's not lined. It's really lightweight. It's even kind of see-through if you look at it. The sleeve is a three-quarter sleeves and it does come sewn up. This is not something that you can adjust. It does look like it has two buttons here in the front, two little tortoise buttons and then there's a matching trouser short so it does have belt loops you have that little pleat in the front it does have pockets and then the back does have this elastic and it does also have these kind of faux suit pockets in the back and just looking at these it looks like they're probably gonna hit about mid thigh but I'm interested to try them on and see I think I'm going to love this together but I would also wear these shorts just with a t-shirt put it on with a tank top the shorts are 17 and the blazer is only 23. I think that's a great price. Now the hot pink pants, I was expecting to be that same linen blend, but it's not. This is a completely different material. We looked it up. These are actually rayon. Online, they do show the pants with the blazer. I probably wouldn't wear them together, but it is the exact same color, so you definitely could. It's the same story on the pants, so you have the belt loops in the front, you have the little pleat detail, you pockets, and the back is elastic. You have those same style pockets. This is a wide leg pant, and on the model, they're showing this looking a little cropped, so I'm interested to see where this hits me. They do have this listed as a 30 inch inseam, which I'm 5'2", so on me, that should be a little long, so we'll see where that hits. These are available in black as well as blue. And I'm looking at the label, they are actually calling this color smoke and hot pink. I knew this was gonna be a good buy, so I went ahead and picked them up in black as well. You cannot go wrong with a lightweight black trouser. And then I did pick up the same linen blend set in black. This is also available in a natural color. I think you can't go wrong with any of them. I know I have the shorts somewhere in one of these boxes. And I'm always on the lookout for handbags at Walmart. I feel like that's the one area that they lack. Y'all let me know if you agree below. But I did pick up this $13 handbag. I've seen a lot of designers have this similar style. It's kind of a mini bag with a top handle, but what's really how you're gonna wear it is with the crossbody strap. So I'm gonna break into it. And I actually have a little Michael Kors yellow bag that has a really similar style to this that was at least a hundred plus dollars. So I think this is a pretty good deal at 13. I went ahead and got it in the black, but it's also available in a floral. That might not be bad. So this one does have just one large open compartment. There's no pockets. It doesn't look like on the inside. So it has gold hardware. It's a good color gold and the strap is doubled up, but it is adjustable. So you can make it longer, wear it like a crossbody, which is how I'm going to wear it. And it does have kind of a buttery feel. I'm going to just hang this on a doorknob. That way the straps will pull and straighten out but I'm giving this a five out of five stars for $13. And I had these slides delivered from store. These are from Time and True, and I really just liked the look of them being all black. They're gonna match a lot. They also have this woven upper. It kind of looks like that designer Bottega braid, and these are $13, no, I'm sorry, $12, which is a great deal. These definitely have the feel of a water shoe. I would not go walk around all day in these. I would wear these to the pool. I'd wear them on vacation. And just at first glance, they do look a little big. I picked these up just in my typical size nine. And yeah, they're a smidge big and they're a little wide. So if you have a narrow foot, I would probably skip these. Um, and also if you're in between sizes, I would probably size one down. Since I'm just gonna wear these like a water shoe, I'm not gonna be that picky on the sizing. The nine is fine for me. And black is the only color these come in. Now something that I would wear to go run errands, walk around quite a bit, are these shorts. I cannot even express to you guys how excited I am that Athletic Works brought these shorts back. I feel like I discovered them a little bit later in the season when all the good colors were sold out, so I am not making that mistake this year. I don't know how many pairs I have in today's order and my recent ordering, but whichever color I can get my hands on, I'm buying up. This is a fun kind of butter yellow. And these shorts are $10. If you bought similar styles from Free People, Lululemon, they would be two to four times the price. So instead, you can just get all the fun colors in the Walmart ones. These I did pick up in a small. They do have the built-in underwear, which is really great for the summer. They also have the mesh on the side. It does have one zipper pocket in the back. They're a moisture wicking material. I live in these in the heat of the summer, but you could also throw these on with a swimsuit if you wanted. And the color that I have here is Yellow Breeze. 
But if you're someone who still has cooler weather, or if you're like me, you like a little bit of cozy with the AC cranked up all the way, then you might like this next sweatshirt from Time and True. I have been stalking this link, waiting for this to drop in my area. I was so excited to get my hands on it. There's a few different options under this link, but the graphic location sweatshirts are definitely having a moment. You'll see that from retailers like Revolve, you'll see it on Abercrombie. This one from Walmart was $15. I did go ahead and size one up in this. I do like my sweatshirts to be a little more oversized. It has a clean look. It does say in navy riding, New York City. There's a California version under this link as well as a couple of concert tees. And it does have light fleece lining. So again, if you're having cooler weather, I think this makes a great transition wear. And I have been waiting for this next item to get here. It is this jumpsuit from Scoop and this comes in so many colors online. If you are into bright pink, cobalt blue, it also comes in a black that you can't go wrong with. But I did pick it up in this champagne color. They're actually calling this oyster gray online. It is not gray. It definitely leans more on that beigey taupe side. And it has a really fun utility look from the front pockets here. It does have a matching um, fabric belt so you can tie in the waist. You have more cargo pockets on the bottom and it is a wide leg style. And this is another one online that they're showing cropped on the models. So I'm really interested to see where this hits me. Oh, and I'm also seeing that it does cover the buttons in the front. This jumpsuit has a great look to it. I also love how easy this is. You have a whole outfit ready to go and you could dress this up or dress it down, throw it on with sneakers. You could also throw it on with a high heel. I'm actually leaving for Vegas this week. This is going in the suitcase. I also think that jumpsuit would look fantastic with a jacket, but I was so happy to see that this jacket restocked for my location. It's from Scoop in this white, they're actually calling this whisper white, faux leather moto jacket style. This is one of my favorite things that Scoop does. So I love that they're dropping these seasonally. It does have silver hardware. You guys have heard me go on and on about how much I love this jacket. It might be available in a couple of other colors, but I also wanted to mention that I ordered this online, but since I ordered it, I did see these at my local Walmart. So another one that be sure to double check the link and check in store. And another repurchase for me is this No Boundaries button down. I did pick this up in a blue and white stripe that is going to be so good for the spring and summer season. I actually recently wore it as a swimsuit cover up, but I would equally wear it buttoned up with a pair of shorts, a pair of jeans. And so I went ahead and ordered it just in the plain white version. And this top just has your typical button down shirt styling. You have a shirt tail hem, it has a collar. And this is from the brand No Boundaries, which is a junior's brand at Walmart. So I did size one up to a medium. And this shirt is 100% cotton, which natural fibers as we're moving into hotter weather is always a good choice. It's gonna be nice and breezy. And you can do so much with a white button down, or you can throw it on with a pair of denim shorts like these time and true ones here. I'm so impressed first glance with these. They have a great look to them, really nice whiskering and minimal deconstructed kind of look just here on the hem. So not nearly as distressed as the scoop pair that I originally showed. They look like they have a nice length to them. I like the wash. They're under $15. That is a great price. And so I did pick these up in a size four. So these do have number sizing. And it says here that these are also 100% cotton. And then with my next couple of items, I was trying to make some athletic looks, but now that I'm feeling this material, I do not think these are workout shorts. I think online Athletic Works is calling this their buttery soft gym short. The buttery soft part, they are not lying, but I personally wouldn't wear these to the gym. I think these make a great lounge short, a great PJ short. So that's how I'm gonna be wearing them. They come in several different colors. The shorts are $7. I will definitely be going after more pairs of these to sleep in. They also do have pockets. And then the tanks are only $6. So I did get the matching color blue. I think they're calling this birch, blue birch. And then I also picked it up in white. And the tanks are racerback style with a higher neck. They also come in more colors. And I'm seeing sticking out of this bag over here. Another color in my favorite Athletic Works workout shorts. This is the color that they are calling Melon Delight. So I also had delivered from store these new No Boundary belt bags. And I took a gamble 
on this orange color and they're calling this color bright apricot it is a really fun bright orange color it's also a great size for a little athletic belt bag when you open it up you do have one large mesh pocket on one side and then you have two mesh pockets on the other side that also have a little bit of stretch to them it does feel like the inside is water resistant on the back, you do have an additional little zipper compartment. I also like that the hardware and the zipper, everything matches the color of the bag. I do think that makes it look more expensive. And then you do have this adjustable nylon strap. I think this is a really well thought out belt bag. I believe it's available in four colors. And I also picked it up in this really fun blue and white checker print. This is a very trendy blue for this year. I think it's gonna look great with white, look great with denim. These are very similar to the styling of the Lululemon belt bags. They remind me more of the size of the XL, if you're familiar with those, and these are only $10. All right, next up is this sweatshirt from the men's department. This is from Free Assembly. This sweatshirt has a really soft, lightweight fleece lining. I did pick it up though because of the color. It does look like peach fuzz, which is the color of the year, if you guys did not know. So keep your eyes peeled for more peach. So I did size one up so I could have more of that oversized fit. I'm gonna wear this with blue jean shorts, but I would also cozy up on the couch in this and it's available in a couple of other colors. And I do have another summer bag. This one is from Time and True, I believe, yes. They are calling this their natural hobo. It does have one strap and then you have this tassel detail here on the side. Walmart natural bags always sell out so quickly. I've already shown two this season that are completely gone. So I know this is one that's gonna go really quickly. And since this is hobo style, I would say that this is more of your beach vacay handbag than your oversized pool tote that you're gonna put all your towels in. Instead, I would grab this for dinner on a trip and it's under $20. Okay, then also rapid fire here. I do have the Scoop Baby Tees. When you know what you like, you should just buy deep, especially at Walmart. I have bought these every season. They have a great feel to them. They actually look for less of the Skims Baby Tees and these are only $10. I get asked about the sizing on these and it really just depends if you wanna wear them as a fitted layer or if you wanna wear them as a standalone top. If you're chestier and you wanna wear them as a standalone top, you might wanna consider sizing one up. That is what I did on this batch. I have these all in mediums, but this year it does come in hot pink, comes in gray, white, and black. These are just a good basic that you're gonna get a lot of use out of in your wardrobe. And what I also like about these is typically the baby tees are super cropped. These just more skim your pant line. All right, let's get into some of these boxes. And here I do have this denim handbag from No Boundaries. Oh my gosh, this bag is so much cuter in person. I wasn't sure what to expect with this one, but it does come in two different denim washes. This is just the denim. There's also a dark denim that almost looks black. It does have these really fun functional cargo pockets here in the front does have those same pockets on the side. You can either wear this top handle, which it does look like the top handle straps are also adjustable, but then it does also come with a crossbody strap. The bag has a great feel to it. On the inside, it looks like it's just one large open compartment. No, I take it back. It does have one zipper compartment on the side, and this is an east-west style, so it's a longer style handbag, which between the denim, the east-west, this is just hitting all the designer bag trends. So I love that you can get this for $19 at Walmart. And then in here, I also have, oh, these are white jeans. I thought these were white shorts. So these are white jeans from Time and True. It does look like this is gonna be more of a crop style. They do have a raw hem. You do have a silver button fly. They feel like they're gonna have nice stretch to it. And I did pick these up in a size four. And yes, they do, the tag is showing that it has some spandex in it. I am really interested to see where this hits me. And you do also have some slight distressing. We just looked it up and these do have a 25 inch inseam. So these are gonna definitely be cropped. And white jeans are another one that never lasts very long. And here I do see I have a pair of blue jeans from Time and True. These are also in a size four and this is their low rise baggy style. I can already tell that these are gonna be oversized. Um, you're not gonna have to size up to get that very trendy look. It has distressing on one of the knees, but I really like the wash on these. I think they have great whiskering and they feel really lightweight. There is 
a difference in my opinion in winter denim, summer denim. To me, this is denim that I would wear in the summer. It is very, very lightweight. And I'm not gonna be scared off that these have low rise in the title because it seems like now anything that's not a very high rise style, we are just calling low rise. So we'll see how these fit. And then in here, I do have this really fun, also peach, by the way, neoprene bag. This is from No Boundaries. I love the color block on this. So it does have that peach color, it has a light pink, and then you have this more neon handle here. They did a version of these last year that were so popular and neoprene styles can be very expensive, weirdly in my opinion. It does have a snap button closure and then it also has snap buttons on the side so you can expand it out or bring it in more if you want. It does have two large zipper pockets on either side. And then it also comes with another interior matching little pouch. So you can either have this clicked in or you can have it free floating in the bag. Especially if you expand out the sides, this bag is huge. This is your moment to throw all your towels, anything you wanna to take to the beach into this bag, it's gonna fit. And also because it's neoprene, you don't have to be worried about putting this on the beach, it getting wet, throwing a wet towel in here. That fabric is gonna stand up and it's available in a couple of other fun summer brights, but it's also available in a really awesome neutral. I wanna say they're calling it the color mocha. So if you are a neutral girl, you gotta pick that bag up. And then I also picked up this dress from Sophia. I went ahead and got it in a solid in the pattern. I was unsure if I would like the pattern, but now that I'm seeing it in person, it's so pretty, especially in the spring and summer months. There are more expensive looking patterns than others. This is one that looks expensive to me. It's honestly giving me a little bit of Versace, especially with the gold inlay here. And then also the fabric has a really nice sheen to it. This is gonna be a slip dress style. It has adjustable straps. You also have this smocking in the back. And I did get the blue dress in a size medium. So I also picked it up in orange. I thought I was ordering a size small. That way I could do a size comparison between the small and the medium. I do have the wrong size here, but it's a great time to mention that this dress is available in an extra small to 3X. But I love this orange color. It's also available in black. That would be great to have. And this dress is $19. I think that's fantastic. You have a whole outfit ready to go for $19. Okay, and I do have some shoes here from Scoop. I did not play it safe when it comes to ordering colors on these. I didn't get the white or the black. I went ahead and picked these up in neon, kind of a neon yellow green. These are so fun. This is a great, very wearable in my opinion, pop of color. This is their block heel mule. I honestly don't know if I feel like this is more green or yellow. Maybe, maybe a little more green. You guys let me know below in the comments what color you feel like this is. It's also trimmed out in black, which I was not expecting. I think they look really expensive. It does also have some cushion in the footbed. I also like how thin the slide part is here as opposed to being all the way across. I think it's gonna be a little bit more flattering on the foot. And in general, the block heel out of all the heels is the most comfortable. So I'm gonna put these on real quick and let you guys know about sizing. My regular size worked out perfect in these. Throw these on with your favorite spring dress for a pop of color. You can have it on with jeans and just a t-shirt. And I thought I would like these. So I went ahead and picked them up in silver, which silver is having a moment right now. It also is metallic, so it's just gonna match everything. They are so, pretty in silver. The silver is very wearable. If you just wanna have a fun extra pop on your shoes, I think this is a great option, but they are, yes, available in black. This does have more of a squared off toe, which I personally think is more wearable than a pointed toe heel. And these do come in whole as well as half sizes. And for today's secret emoji, let's go ahead and make it the flower emoji since we are kicking off spring. So leave me any flower emoji below in the comment section so I know you stuck it out with me till the end of the video. And if you're interested in any of these items, they'll be listed below in the description box as well as over on the pinned comment. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today and I will see y'all in the next one.